Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Alandra and welcome back to another CC showcase. But as you have seen from the title and the thumbnail, today we're doing men. <laughs> we're doing masculine custom content. So CC for your male sims, your masculine sims. Apparently I haven't done this video since 2019, at least I couldn't find it when I searched it on my channel. I didn't know it had been four years. This is one of my most requested videos. So today I have put together a huge CC list of my CC for guys. We have hairs, beards, accessories, tops, bottoms, and shoes. This is an absolutely massive list because like I said, it's been four years. So not all of this stuff is like brand new, but most of it at least shouldn't have been in my last video, which by the way, I will leave a link down below as well because I do still use a bunch of CC from that video as well. But in this one, we have like the newer custom content, the stuff that I've downloaded in the last few years. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know it's been a long time coming, so give the video a thumbs up if you are happy to finally download some CC for your male or masculine sims. And let's get started. We're using Grayson, my male CC model today. Obsessed with him, as always. We'll start off with hairs. I have so many, I'm pretty much just gonna say the name. I guess we should make him a blonde. I always showcase hairs in the blonde color because I feel like you can see the texture a bit better than in a darker color. So this is the hair that he uses every day, every time you've seen him. This is the Everett hair. One of my all time favorite hairs for guys, absolutely obsessed. The next two hairs are from the same post. We have the Daniel hair, which is this one, a longer one. And then the Marcus hair, which is this one. I feel like a lot of these are a little bit similar, but how many hairstyles can guys really have? <laughs> Anyways, next up we have three hairs. We have the Axel, Felix, and Riley hairs. This is the first one. Then we have this one, which is really nice. And then this one is also from the same post, a little bun, obsessed. Then we have the Roman and Xander hairs. Some of these hairs are obviously black hair, I wouldn't normally put them on Grayson. He's just here to showcase the CC. So we have this beautiful curly hair. I'm obsessed. And then the second one is this one. These two are from the same post. Then we have the Brody and Sterling hairs. As you can see, a lot of these come from the same post. The same thing happens with clothes. So we have this one and this one. I think this is the Sterling hair. Really like this one as well. I feel like with this outfit, it fits perfectly. Then we have the Polly, Damien, and Kai hairs. This is the Polly one, the Damien one, and then the Kai one as well. This one's a little bit different. Then we have the Eli hair. This one is brand new. Just got this in like the last month. Then we have the Chandler hair. Loving this one. I don't know. I just love that one. It's so cute. We have the Sebastian hair. Another absolutely stunning hair. I, you guys know if you watch my CC videos, I love the little like loose strands of hair that are asymmetrical. And some of the guy hairs have them as well. So I'm fully obsessed with them. This is the Sylvester hair. Another stunning one. I feel like I do like them even better in the darker colors, but we'll look at them in blonde. This is the Lysander hair really cool it covers his eyes a little bit then this one is the montrose hair we got some dreads really cool then we have the pedro hair which is this one nice moving on to the jacob hair some loose strands again and then this is the marco hair this one's super nice as well. Loving the parting and the little bangs. This is the Carmine hair. Obsessed. A bunch of these here are from the same creator, Sims Trouble. I love their female hairs. And now I have male hairs as well. So this is the Ronnie hair. I have this one for feminine Sims as well. But I feel like, look at it in the round. It looks so good on guys. Like it is a unisex hair. I love it. It's like my longest hair that I think I have for guys and I'm obsessed. This is the Raekwon hair, I think. 
really really cool love it then we have the federico hair which looks like this honestly these are such good quality all of these hairs i'm really excited to finally show them in a video this is the miguel hair we have a little low bun it's kind of messy so nice then we have the Damos hair, this one. You can add some ombre in from the face paint category if you want. Why not? He looks very cool. Same with the next hair. This is the Randy hair. Oh, what's that tiny little bun in the back? Okay, so cute. Okay, then this is the Dennis hair. I feel like this one is pretty new. I love the length of this and how it's kind of like a little bit messy and then the loose strands of hair. This is one of my favorites. Then we have the Kendall hair, which looks like this. We have the Max hair. Oh my god, amazing. Kind of looks like a little bit as, like his original hair, the same vibes. This is the Leo hair. Nice little curly waves. Then we have the Edward and Julian hairs. These are from the same post. Look at the side parting, really cool. And then this is the second one amazing and then we have a couple more um i've gone really fast like i said this is the leander hair love the middle parting really cool we have the neil hair which i'm also obsessed with it's giving me mullet vibes and i love it then we have the caleb hair which is this one another middle parted one and then this one which is really new i don't know how to pronounce this name song jin hair i don't know how to say that um cool it goes over his you know eyebrows and eyes a little bit and it's a little bit like curly wavy uh, unique okay hopefully i'm not going too fast the links are all in the description box and i say the names of all the items as you just saw so you can just click the links based on the names of the items that you like next up i have two beard sets this is the first one. These are both from Green Llama. So the first set has this beard that he's always had. We also have this one, which is like a little bit fuller, a little bit darker. And then this one, which is much fuller. And then I have a newer one. This is called the Beard Set Plus. It's this one. We have like a stronger mustache and whatever this thing is called. We have this one, a little bit more hair. And then this one, really, really nice beard as well. Okay, I do actually have some jewelry. So we have some accessories here. One of my favorite CC creators for jewelry called Christopher067. Recently started making CC for men as well. Well, some of these are a little bit older, but recently there's been a lot more. So I've been downloading all of it. So first up, we have these ocean earrings. These usually just come in all the metallics. I am obsessed. I love having jewelry for men. We also do have the necklace. This is the Alexander necklace. Again, it comes in just loads of different metallic colors. And we even have some rings. These are the Hansen rings. Look how cool. I think you can download them. Yeah, so they're just on one hand, but here I put them on both. I am obsessed. So happy to have that. Then we have the ungodly necklace which is kind of like this choker with pearls um really cool very unique maybe not for every guy but i love it then moving on we have the ritual earrings and necklace so this is a set this is the earrings that i've chosen i think you can pick which ear you want or possibly even both but i've chosen his right ear love it and then this is the necklace again they come in different metallics we have the mission earrings pretty sure you can choose which side which ear has the earring but i love that it's just one i feel like i kind of like that for men then we have the destined earrings and necklace here is the earrings i feel like i have this for women as well and then you can kind of see the necklace as well really really nice and i think i have one more pair of earrings yeah these are the stray earrings again they just come in different metallics i love that they're like mismatched so cool all right let's do some clothing honestly there's so much stuff in this haul i was worried the cc list wasn't gonna fit in the description box but i think it just about fits so the first clothing item we have today is this devon top it comes in loads of plain swatches and then we do have some fun 
pattern swatches down here as well and it's kind of like tucked in which I love I feel like it looks really good then we have the love on the floor shirt which is this one it's kind of like open in the front it comes in all these different swatches and then you can download this thing in gloves which is this like lace undershirt so you can add that in if you want comes in black and white i thought that was kind of cool okay moving on next up we have the red sign jumper it's tucked in again absolutely love this i feel like for this one you can download like a polo like a turtleneck to put underneath but yeah this one comes in a load of different patterns and then some solids as well super maxis match super nice then we have the answer t-shirt this might have been in my last video as well because this is old but i love this t-shirt i have like the same one for feminine sims there's so many different prints and then just basic swatches then we have the kick it jacket so cool there's a bunch of different swatches as well like they change a lot this is awesome. I love this. Then we have the sleeveless top and pants. So these were from the same post, so I'm just going to show them at the same time. This top is kind of cropped and we do have like a bunch of different prints in the front and then some patterns and some solid swatches. And then these are the uh, pants as well. I chose this swatch with the flames, but there are a bunch of different patterns in here and solid swatches as well then this is the promise jumper look how huge and long this is kind of obsessed i want the exact same thing for my feminine sims we have some patterns and then some solid swatches as well i love it it's so cute then next up we have the pollen polo shirt this is really nice. So Max's match. Kind of obsessed with this look actually. So we have plain swatches and then some patterned and some striped swatches. I think it's super nice. Then we have the Daniel top, which is this one. Look at the daisies on the vest. This is so freaking cute. Oh my god, I just realized this hair I forgot because I was showcasing it in blonde. It has the option to change the color of the front bits. I think this is like the Brody hair or something if you do want to get it. But yeah, I am obsessed with this vest and shirt combination. And if you go in gloves, you can change the color of the shirt underneath if you download this file as well. Super cute, honestly obsessed. Then we have the summer break set. So we have a couple of things from this set. We have this top and shorts combo. By the way, I have like no full body CC for men. So this is all tops and bottoms. I guess that makes sense, but this is the top. So Maxis match really nice. And then we have the matching denim shorts as well. Let's do the pink very cute and then this top is also from the summer break set i love the prints on this like some of these like especially this one i think there's some more in here as well like look at these very very nice and then we do have just like no do we not have solid swatches i thought we did never mind they all have some kind of print but i love the prints so I'm not mad. Okay, moving on to the men's jackets. Again, I feel like these might have been in the last video, but I love them, so I'm gonna show them again. Um, and besides, that was in 2019. I'm pretty sure 99% of you did not watch that video. <laughs> but here's the first jacket. It's long, it has a little textured polo underneath, very nice. And then here is the other jacket. This one gives more like rain jacket vibes, especially since we do have the yellow, but it could just be a nice like autumn winter jacket. Then moving on, we have the Lucas top, which is this t-shirt with a bunch of prints. I really like it. Oh yeah, some of these prints are crazy. Oh my God, look at them. Yep. Yeah. There's a lot to choose from. Then we have the Kevin top and the Sean top. So these are together. This is the Kevin one. Loads of different patterns. I believe I also downloaded, yep, the non-patterned version. Very nice. And then, like I said from the same pose, the Sean top again. I have it in patterns. Loads of really cool simlish patterns in here. And then also solid swatches. I love that it's kind of tucked in as well. Very, very cute. This 
is the Carter top. So this one comes from a big CC pack that has loads of items. So the Carter top, the Blaine sweater, the Danny jacket, and the Adrian top, which are the next four things I'm showing. They're all from the same link. It's a little bit confusing, but I have to make the CC list shorter and not link everything separately. <laughs> so I've wrote them all down under the same link. This, like I said, is the Carter top. And this is one of my favorite things that I have. I always put this on my mail sims and there's so many different options for prints and stuff, for different aesthetics. I love it. This was the Blaine sweater. It's giving me dad vibes. Loving the texture of the sweater though. And then we can see the color of the shirt underneath and we have all these different colors for the sweater. This was the Danny jacket. It's a little bit like cropped, it's a little bit shorter than my other jackets, but it's a nice denim jacket. And then this is the Adrian top as well. I have it in solids right here. All these items that have the ANA logo, they usually have the same color palette, so it's really easy to make some match between the different items. They don't have all the same patterns, but I feel like they're still great for mixing and matching. So this is the pattern version, uh, very, very cool. Then we have the John sweater and Felix cardigan from the same post. This is the John sweater. I love this swatch. It's my favorite. We also have it in a couple of different colors. Then we have like just loads of different patterns in here. And oh my God. Oh yeah, here are the gradient swatches as well. And then for the Felix cardigan, it's this one. Look how cute this swatch is. But again, there's a million different swatches, honestly. All different aesthetics are included. And then if you want, you can just have, you know, the plain swatch with no pattern. <laughs> so cute. All right, next up we have the Brandon top and the Nicholas sweater. Again, from the same link. This is another one of my favorites. I just love this. This could be great for teenagers as well and young adults. And I just love the t-shirt over the hoodie. And then there's so many different prints on the shirt. And just, this is so cool. I love it. This was the Nicholas sweater. It's like a little bit ripped up in places, but I love the texture of it. I just think it's very cool. I don't know. I'm not sure how to style it always, but I love it. Then we have the... Colin sweater, Danny top, and Alistair sweater, all from the same post. This is the Colin sweater with the vest with the llama. Excuse me, look how cool he looks. Obviously, we have the same color palette again. Then this was the uh, Danny top. Very cool. Again, we have like the t-shirt over the long sleeve shirt. And then look at all these swatches. Very, very cool. And I also have it without the print in the front. And then the Alistair sweater is this one. We have the plain swatches. You know the deal by now. Where's my favorite swatch for this? This one with the flowers and like the different colors on the sleeves and stuff. Very cool. But again, so many different options. Love that one. Then we have the Jackson sweater. This is really new. It's kind of giving me like dad vibes again. We have all the patterns, so many, and then we have these solids as well. All right, moving on. This is the Sven sweater vest. This is cool, kind of new. I love the kind of like gradient tie-dye colors of this. Really nice. Oh, and we have like a couple patterns as well. Then we have the uh, Ray blouse, which is this one. I really like the solids for this. We do have some patterns, but they are way out there. I don't know if I have a Sim who would wear these patterns, but they're very cool. But the solids are just super maxis match. Then we have a jacket. This is called the Ash jacket. It's a little bit cropped, but I love how soft it looks. It's like a little teddy jacket. We have a bunch of colors for it as well. We have the Callum hoodie. This is what he wears in his everyday outfit, usually, because I'm obsessed with this. So we have the hoodie underneath and then the jacket. So I have some plain swatches. It's so nice and so Max's Munch. I'm fully obsessed with it. Then we have this, which I, again, cannot pronounce. Kong Jin Cardigan? <laughs> 
it. <laughs> don't roast me, but I love this. I don't have anything else like this. It's a, such a nice cardigan. And then we have like a, a bunch of like dark earthy toned colors. It's so nice, very, very nice. Then we have this, which is the exploded jumper. As you can see, um, it does look a little bit exploded. It's ripped in a bunch of places. This is the main swatch. That's, I feel like that's like a skull, but it has a bunch of really cool, unique swatches. And then not all of them are ripped as you can see. And then we have like the basic swatches. I think it's very, very cool. Then we have the Luca sweater and the Luca pants. So these are from the same post. This is the sweater. Really, really nice. So Maxis Match and huge color palette. And then we have some of these where the shirt underneath changes color as well. And then the pants are from the same post. So I'll just show them right now. Um, we have these ones with the pattern and then you can also get the pattern less one they're really skinny really nice okay then i saved the suits for last these are all two-piece suits i love these so so much first up we have the ezra suit so look at just just look at this and then the shirt under the vest is kind of like mesh like a little bit see-through I just find that so cool. We have some of these are patterned. Like, I love this one. And then the pants obviously match. So let me just give you the whole suit. Like, excuse me, absolutely stunning. Then we have the senior suit and the old school suit. So these are from the same post. This is the first one, just all these different colors. Obviously, you can match the bottoms. Really nice suit. And then the second one, the old school one. It looks like this. We have the bow tie. Yep, very, very cool. And then lastly, we have the resolution suit, which is a little bit different, as you can see. But it is a matching, like, two-piece suit. It's a little bit shiny. We have all these colors. <gasps> Let's see the matching bottoms for this one. So freaking cool. Okay, so we have the bottoms category left and shoes left. Like I said, I don't have anything in a full body. People do not make full body clothes or outfits for masculine sims. It makes sense to me. It's fine. We're starting off with these suspended pants, which I thought they were just like regular pants. But then I came down here and I love these like extra swatches and like the pants that he was wearing. Like this swatch, absolutely stunning. I am obsessed with these pants. So those are the suspended pants. And then we have the expelled jeans that look like this. Very nice. We have just basic denim swatches for these. Then we have these leather pants from Trilica. So shiny. They're almost so shiny that they're alpha. They're kind of on the line. We have a couple different swatches for these. If you want leather pants, here you go. Very cool. Then we have the Gavin jeans. I think these are super old and I showed these in my last video, but they're still like my favorite jeans that I have for masculine sims. I just think they're super nice. And then this is from the same pose. The Gavin jeans also come in like this ripped, distressed version. I love them. They're like my favorite jeans. So I wanted to show them again. Okay, next up we have the takeoff pants. Um, They have a belt and then they have a chain. And as you can see, we have the ripped knees. And these come with ooh, some different things. We have patterns. These are kind of fun. Oh, we have the flames, of course. Oh, and yeah, the ripped jeans aren't in every swatch apparently. You saw those ones. So then we are moving on to these ones. These are the Finn shorts. Super nice, super maxis match, honestly. These look like they just came from a pack. And then we do have some fun colors in here. So nice. Oh my gosh. Then these are the ASA bottoms. ASA bottoms. I don't know how you're supposed to say that. Really nice. I love these. They're super maxi smudge and they come in all the different colors. Very cute. So then we have these ones, which are the peat jeans. They do have a belt like that. These are from Clumsy Alien. Just nice jeans that come in just some different denim swatches. I think, yeah, I also have another pair of jeans from Clumsy Alien. These are the iron pants. They also have a belt. Let's just make him shirtless for a second there. They have a belt. I like that they're like a little bit cropped, a little bit shorter. And these ones come in even more colors. 
I really love those. Then moving on, we have a bunch of bottoms from the same post. Okay, here we are. So we have the Ricky jeans, the Noah shorts, and the Daniela shorts. These are the Ricky jeans. I feel like I have these for women as well, because I just love the pattern. Then from the same post again, these are the Noah shorts. Really like basic, but nice shorts. I like the length and they have a belt and they just come in the different denim swatches. And then also the Daniel shorts, which are these ones. These ones come in obviously the different denim swatches, but then also they have like different patches. The shirt is a little bit long, so it's covering some of them, but trust me, they're really nice patches in there. Then next up we have the Kent jeans. Here we have the white swatch. These, by the way, also have a black belt. You can kind of see it here in the picture. Here are all the denim swatches. Then we have the Troy and Marco jeans from the same post. This is the Troy jeans. We have these big rips in the front. And then the Marco jeans are these ones. Really nice straight jeans. I like them a lot. Then we have the Isaiah and Aiden shorts and also from the same pose the Cameron pants and Elijah jeans which I will showcase now so the next four pants are from the same post. These are the Isaiah shorts. These are very nice. They also have this version as you can see in the picture here. This is like the plain one but then this one had the belt and the chain on the side. From the same post we have the Aiden shorts which are these ones. I like the material of these. They're not denim. She was super nice. The pink was so cute. Still from the same post, the Cameron pants. So this is the basic swatch, you know, with just the denim swatches. I really love these. And then we have these ones, you know, with the different patterns and patches and stuff. So cool. I love these. Wait, so these were the Elijah jeans and these are the Cameron pants. I don't know if I said those the other way around. Obviously, those ones were the jeans. These are like cargoes. Really nice. We, they come in all the different swatches as well. But yeah, still from the same post. Uh, then the last three pairs of pants are all from the same post as well. Sorry if it's confusing. These just happen to be from Big CZ Packs and... Why would I link the same link so many times? So these are the Philip khakis and yeah, they come in a lot of patterns, which are really cool. And then you can also get them with no patterns at all. Very nice. These are the Darius jeans. This is the last link in the bottoms category. They have a belt and a chain. Did I? Yes, I also downloaded them without the chain and the belt. So you can pick and choose which one you want or both like I do. I have both of them. And then these are the last pairs of bottoms. These are the set shorts. These are cool. They give me a werewolves pack vibes. <laughs> I feel like maybe they're an edit from that pack. Very nice. Okay, lastly, we have the shoes category. I don't have that many shoes for men. Well, some of these are super old check out my last video but first up we have the alex sneakers i think i downloaded these for women as well these are just like some nice basic sneakers with loads of different colors then we have the checkerboard sneakers which i do also have for feminine sims so we have all these different colors these are so freaking cool then we have the moonlight sneakers Again, which look like this, loads of different color options. Then the grunge revamp shoes. So this post came with two shoes. I think they're edited from the new kit. What is it called? Like grunge revival or something like that. So we have these swatches. So very, very cool. And then the other pair from the same grunge revamp shoes post. So again, we have like these swatches. Very nice, I like them a lot. And then I have two collections from Juice. So we have the men's shoes collection number two. So I have a couple of shoes from that. Oh. So we have these really nice sandals. We also have these shoes, which come in a bunch of different colors. I like them a lot. We have these loafers, which are so freaking cute. Look at the different swatches. And also these shoes as well come with a couple of swatches as well and then these are the last pair of shoes from the first collection 
And then for the second collection, so men's shoes collection, 03, number three, we have these trainers. Are these trainers? What do you call this type of shoe? Not sure. We have a couple different colors. Then we have these ones in darker colors. We have these really nice shoes as well in some nice swatches. And then we have one more pair of sandals. So these just come in a bunch of darker colors. Oh my god, we're finally done. My office is so hot. I hate recording long videos because I have to turn my fan off. Otherwise, it messes with the audio. But yeah, there is my huge massive CC haul for masculine sims. Please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, if you found some new CC. This video took me forever to make. But it's finally here. I hope you guys did find some new custom content for your masculine sims because they just don't have as much as feminine sims and they deserve to look good as well. Anyways, the CC list is in the description box like always. Let me know in the comments what other CC videos I should do and which items from this video were your favorites. Pretty sure Grayson is on the gallery if you want to download him. My gallery ID is IlyandraYT. But yeah, that's all from this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!